Hey babe. Oh, uh, where are you? It's really dark in here. Can you turn on the lights? What? The power's out. But no. No. <laughs> I don't like this. I don't like this at all. But I am glad that we have a fireplace or else it <laughs> couldn't be long until we most likely started to freeze. Yeah. <laughs> oh my God. Why is this happening? No. Is it just us or the entire, <laughs> the entire neighborhood looks like it's uh guys it's so dark. <laughs> so we have no power. Well that's just <laughs> awesome. <laughs> Okay, so, um, do you know where I put the snuggle box? <laughs> I'm talking about the box I made last year with a lot of stuff in it. Like, uh, I think I had a big blanket to cuddle up in. It's very soft and warm. And, um... I think this could be the perfect time to use that box. <laughs> mm, okay. Oh, there it is. <laughs> oh, I almost stubbed my toe. Uh, well, I'm glad I didn't do that. <laughs> mm, let me see. Oh, here's the blanket. Mm, so nice, so nice. Hmm. What else did I put in here? Oh, I don't think we could use the tea since um, we have no way of warming it up. Because I don't have any kind of tea kettle we can put all on the fireplace. So that's a no. I got some fuzzy socks in here, but... <laughs> It's not that cold yet, and I have my cute slippers with the bunny ears. <laughs> I know, very cliche. <laughs> hmm. Let's see. Hmm. I don't think I need the teddy bear because I got you. Mm, and you you want to cuddle me, right? Or else I could just use the teddy bear. That's okay by me. But that, then you're not getting into the blanket either because that's for snuggle cuddling. Okay. Hmm. Well, I have other warm things in here like scarves and stuff. But uh, I'm not going outside. It's uh, number one, it's uh, cold. Uh, number two, it's very dark out since there's no <laughs> electricity. <laughs> so I wouldn't be able to see anything. Oh, I have some candles in here too. I think I put them in as an afterthought, but that's very good. That's nice. So let me just light some of this candles let's see okay that's one um, and then that's two well hello there stranger who are you <laughs> i'm just joking 
and then I'm going to put them in these so they don't fall over and set the whole place ablaze. Hmm, place ablaze. <laughs> that sounded funny. Okay, so now we have everything we need. And now we can sit under here and sit down. And then I will mm, snuggle up beside you. Well, this is not what I had planned for today, but I, this is nice. <laughs> oh, I didn't know that those were scented. Oh, the candles. <laughs> Well, that's nice. <sighs> you know what I did when I was younger and the fire was out? Fire? No, the light was out. I, I'm just focusing on the fire. I'm, I'm sorry. <laughs> no, when the lights were out, I would usually get, um... I didn't get a normal candle. I got one of those electric ones that yeah, there are batteries. And then I would put it down on the floor and get my my teddy bears and my Barbie and actually just anything that I played with. And then we would sit in a circle and talk about anything, really. It all depended on what time of year it was because if it was in summer we didn't really need the light so it would just have it there but not turn it on <laughs> oh yes i know i was adorable and i still am <laughs> what do you mean uh, you're you're the one that always calls me adorable <laughs> well i need to continue my story Duh. <laughs> so we would talk about the current events. Kind of like a little sleepover, even though, yeah, it wasn't a sleepover. <laughs> and then, well, we would talk about the thing with happening. And if it was around Christmas time, <gasps> then we had to talk about what we wanted for Christmas and how we were looking forward to all the yummy food and of course the candy mm, can't forget about the candy and the cookies my gosh the cookies <laughs> oh, I had a lot of fun <laughs> do you know one time my dad even came into the room carrying some uh, uh, cookies and <laughs> some uh, like um I don't remember. I think it was soda? No. Well, something. Something with taste. <laughs> I don't know. Um, but he would come in and he would look around and be really confused seeing me just sitting in the middle of the room with my teddy bears and all the other stuff I play with. And um, he would just say, it, ask me if are you the only one in here? And I would be like, yeah, it's just me. Why? And then he looked down at the tray he was carrying and like being um, a bit, okay, so you only need one glass then. <laughs> oh, he was so cute with the, he, he, but he, he left me the cookies and he left me the glass of whatever it was. I don't really remember that. It's a long time ago. <laughs> but it was so, so funny. Like, um, I was alone in my room, but my dad thought it was me and two other people. So I, I must have had a very convincing other voices. <laughs> How did that happen? I don't know. <laughs> Uh, but that that image is just going to get stuck in my head for a long, long time. <laughs> I even wrote it down. 
I think I have it one place around here in one of my books, but I kind of don't want to read when I only have the flickering lights of the candles. <laughs> I don't want to strain my eyes that much. <sighs> Do you any have any funny stories from when you were younger? What you would do when the <laughs> when the lights went out, when the power was just gone. You do. Hmm. Will you tell me some? <laughs>